You're watching Region 8 News Midday with Diana Davis and meteorologist Zach Holder. It's a major milestone. The Greene County Community Fund will celebrate 60 years of existence on September 12th. Paragold Mayor Josh Agee signed a proclamation. It makes September 12th an online day of giving designed to ignite a spirit of giving. And joining us now is Laria Baker, Executive Director of the Greene County Community Fund. Thank you so much for joining us today on Midday. Thank you so much for allowing us to come in and tell everyone Everybody about this great little hidden gem that we have up it in is. Greene County. It is, and we can't help but notice there's a, a large Ryan Vaughn <laughs> over your shoulder. <laughs> what is this all about? This is one of the many events that help fund the community It is. Community um, fund. We have a celebrity waiter that's coming up, and a couple years ago, before the whole transition of COVID, uh, we had a huge success. We had a celebrity waiter where we had different celebrities in the community and Ryan Vaughn being <laughs> that one uh, big celebrity that came in and helped us raise money that night. The whole night is just, it's a fun event where it brings in celebrities, local celebrities within our area, and they actually do the waiting <laughs> on us instead of us waiting on them. And they do it all for tips and all in the fun of raising money for the Greene County Community Fund. Now let's talk about what the fund does there in Greene County. County, 60 years, a very long time, and you support organizations that people will recognize. Let's talk about some of those. What right. Can you see? Um, so this coming year, we will be supporting 16 nonprofit agencies in Greene County, and those agencies range from anywhere from uh, working with recovery houses like Agape House or In His Wings Ministry. Uh, we are recently bringing in Together We Foster. We'll be supporting them in 2023, which is a new group on the horizon, but does great things with foster care in our yes. area. Um, we also will be bringing in Options, which is another great nonprofit in our area that deserves the support of the citizens there in Greene County. We have um, the 4-H, Greene County 4-H is totally supported by the Greene County Community Fund, as well as the Rescue Squad. Um, and there are several other agencies. It, go on our website, they're listed on there. They can give you all the information and you can get links to each one of them where you can go in and find out who we are serving for 2023. And you want to be a part of this event. Absolutely. There's sponsorships and tickets to be had. So how can there we get is. our hands on a ticket? So go on to our website at www gccfund.org and there is a link on there where you can go in and it'll get you signed up for all the different sponsorship packages um, and become part of the day for the night events um, that's going to be held on the 24th of the September. 24th. But September 12th is the big day because that is when you're recognizing 60 years. 60 years, yes. And that 60 years, September the 12th of 1962 uh, was when this organization was put down on paper that we are going to support our citizens in Greene County. And so as out of celebration for that, Mayor AG said, let's do a proclamation where every year we can give. And this will be the set date. September the 12th nice. will be the day that is set up as the Greens Giving Day. Wonderful. Laurie, thank you so much for giving us an understanding of the Greene County Community Fund. And I know someone else who's from Greene County. Zach Holder, yes. you grew up there. 